don't know if it's always going to be that slappy, wet muck. Get used to it, I suppose. Starting tunneling is a huge milestone for everybody involved in the project. It's something we've been working towards for many, many years. We're at the uh, front of the tunnel boring machine. We're starting this machine, which is a, a really exciting point for us on the whole project. We are in the cabin where the TBM driver is. He's controlling the face of the TBM that is behind me. And all these screens plus more are on the control room, which is in the office. So now we've got the TBM switched on, we're going to start cutting into the tunnel face. What that means is the front of the tunnel boring machine is going to start turning, it's going to start eating away at the mud from the tunnel face and bring it back towards the back of the machine. All the muck that will come out of the TBM will be carried away by conveyor belts across the shaft and up to the surface. It comes vertically up the shaft in between two belts and then it gets dropped onto another belt that brings it back up this way and drops it off into the barge. The barge takes 1,600 tonnes to fill and our muck lorry takes 16 tonnes, so it's equivalent of 100 lorries. Down at the end of the jetty, we've got a supervisor who will be in the man rider. He will communicate via radio to guys who are controlling the tele stacker who can move it left and right to even out the spoil as it enters the barge. This is the first muck barge being filled and on the other side of here we've got the uh, segment barge getting emptied as well. This is the second segment barge with the next 30 rings in it. We've committed to bring in all of our precast segments in by river. So the segments are being cast out in the Isle of Grain and then they're also being transported by barge here to Curling Street up the River Thames. We managed to build our first ring which is the first tunnel ring on the whole project. We've been leading to this for the last three years, effectively. As we push forward, we build a ring within the shield of the tunnel boring machine, and then we use that to push ourselves forward and push into the ground in front, continuing on the excavation. We can't launch the whole 120 metres of TBM in this situation because we've only got a 30 metre shaft, so we have to do it in sections. Behind me, you can see all the component parts that are going to make up the back end of the TBM. Each one has to be lowered down in a section and then added to the tunnel boring machine so it can move along like the factory on wheels that it is. So as you can see, the belts have now stopped moving. That marks the first barge being filled, which will now be taken away downriver. It's a huge milestone for the project. A lot of hard work ahead, but it's really great to get going. It's a relief, to be honest with you. It's a really amazing project, so I'm really happy to be part of the team. Next two or three years of tunneling, bring it on.